have our CIS 150 app. We just click on it. We can get it started. Our CIS 150 app allows us to look at our lecture participation points, our assignment checklist, our schedules, and you can also email your professor if you would like. Um, you can go to the More button, click on it, um, and that brings us to extra stuff that we can see, um, like our binary encoding that we use during class, um, our midterm review, final review, stuff like that. And we can go back to a, a learning tab that allows us to look at different kinds of games we can do, like a game, textbook slides, um, our class playlist, our YouTube channel, which helps us during, our tech skills, um, and our SAM paths. Um, and then we also go the My Game, which is also in this upper corner here. Click on that. This is basically the game we use for class. Um, and we look, obviously, I'm not doing so well. Um, but we can scroll down and kind of look here and we can go to our missions and that shows us what we can accomplish, what we did accomplish, um, and there's just kind of different things there. And it keeps going and how you actually do the mission is you look at what you need, like let's say we need to complete a di optional SAN assignments in the post exam. What you would do is actually in the SAN pass for this one, you would actually do it and it eventually gets uploaded to it. Um, but other examples, um, let's see. So adding a new mobile device to the game um, or even answering a question, you would go to the code button and it acts as if we slay a dragon, which we use to put the answer in here and then we claim it and then it automatically goes back here and it says that we did it and it shows us in our profile system and that's where we're at right now and then it also has another tab in the upper corner about the leadership board and that goes to see who's high so I am 21 out of everyone so I guess I'm not too bad um, but yeah that's how our, this app works and it goes along with our class very well and it helps people to study and know what's coming up in our schedules and I just think it's a really good app to use so you should use it